from this unit right now. Douglas Wilson backing in on Trace Jackson Davis. Lead scorer for the Jackrabbits. Goes up with the right hand and has a nice smooth finish. He's going to be all over the floor today. That length should be fun to watch. Smith back again. Mismatch on Friedel, and he cans a little turnaround. Friedel off the corner, missed everything. Losers now on the run. Durham lobs ahead to Franklin. Blocked by Dentlinger. TJD's follow not there. Hoosiers shoot 75% on the foul line as a club. Brunk misses both. Trace Jackson Davis able to muscle in the offensive rebound. Armand Franklin tracks down the loose ball. Bounce pass in. TJD with a slam. Very disciplined play by the Jackrabbits. They're not forcing anything. Okay, maybe I spoke a little early. He might have forced that one a little bit, but it worked out in his favor. Both teams struggling from the floor. Alex Arians had that last bucket. He drives into the paint. Gets the roll on the left-handed floater. Johnson ties up the game at six. Arians, just a beautiful drive. It's simple as that, just a little hook. Durham's three, pure. Al Durham. Five to shoot for David Winjit. He kicks it out. Baylor Shireman, true freshman lefty, banks it in. Here is Anderson. Green triggers another three and splashes it home. Devontae Green, two for two from deep. Shireman, swing over to Key. He's got an open look, and he hits nothing but net. Second team foul on Indiana. Buchanan drives in, goes up high and hits it off the glass. Going over Davis as well. Trey Buchanan, that's the difference right now for Indiana. Big swat by TJD. Smith up ahead. And he hammers it down. Bang. Dylan gives it up. Wins it. Ball fake. Drive. And TJD with another block again. All ball. And it's a shot clock violation against South Dakota State. He's a better player now than what he would have been last year. His body is growing. He's getting stronger. And it's showing every game. Justin Smith finishes with the foul. He's got an opportunity for a three-point plate. In on the baseline, circling back out into the paint. Jump stop, kick to Buchanan. Forced up a three and bags it in. Got that one in, over the face of Devontae Green. Somehow keeps it on the corner. Eight on the shot clock. Jackson Davis rolls and banks it in. What a move by Trace Jackson Davis. Able to flip it up. Buchanan between the legs, dribble on Anderson. Three on the clock. A little runner goes down. Trey Buchanan hits it with the right hand. That's how the first half comes to a close. Same starting five for South Dakota State as well. Friedel and Arians. Key as well. Dentlinger and Douglas. He drives in, kicks out. Friedel pops a three. Did not get it. Rebound by Wilson. Able to battle over Jackson Davis. Bronk able to block it from behind. Now a run out for the Hoosiers. Key matched up with Franklin. 23-year-old up against the true freshman. High entry pass, and Wilson's able to make the catch and turn it up with the right hand for two. Friedel tees up a three. In and out. Batted away by Dentlinger into the hands of Green. Maybe a chance for a break. Lob, and Jackson Davis hangs it down. A lot of different guys shining through different nights, and that's an awesome advantage for Indiana to have. Good position for TJD, and he finishes with the left hand. Trace Jackson Davis to get too aggressive because you don't want to risk the charge, but we'll see if Wilson can provide some last second energy here. Buchanan with a little mid-range floater and it falls and a hard fall by Wilson. Key looking for Wilson instead Buchanan saves him. 10 on the shot clock. Trey Buchanan skips into the lane. Nice little adjustment with the left hand. He's had a good game off the bench. Look at that percentage. 8 of 16, 50%. Indiana wants that to be a little higher. They're not getting to the line as usual as they are today. Uh, Trey Buchanan has been able to score him in little spurts off the bench to bring him back within 10. Green with the answer, draining a three at the other end. He steps through, Dentlinger blocked by Trace Jackson Davis again. By 14, Friedel lost it on the way in. Smith flips it ahead. Anderson's got TJD on the lob, bang! And that's when Davis is definitely gonna want back. Alou Dillon on the other end, and he puts it in for two. Former AAU teammate of Justin Smith. The last 40 home games, South Dakota State. So they'll go back into the Summit League as one of the conference favorites, Al Durham, with one last 
postering block against Matt Dentlinger.